Good morning, 5th graders. Today is October 1st, 2014. Welcome to October. And our lesson today is Lesson 2-6. And my question for you today is how do we convert customary system um, of measurements, measurements, measurement, measurements. Uh, now, we skipped a lesson earlier this, this unit that was dealing with the metric system, just because we're going to deal with the metric system later, and I thought of all the important things that we need to focus on. Let's skip the metric system, and let's focus on... Um, the customary because quite honestly uh, the United States does not use the metric system we use the customary system of measurement and we will be working on that today so the first thing we should probably do is we should probably talk about what they are the first one that most of us are familiar with is inch okay and then we have foot and then we have yard Okay. Now, I am not putting mile on here because none of the measurements we are going to be using with include mile, but if we wanted to, we could include mile, but we're not going to. And I also want to talk about, let's look at our conversions. Now, hopefully this is nothing new to us, but one foot is equal to 12 inches. Um, one yard is equal to three feet and then we can go which is equal to 36 inches now that's going to be the basis for all the conversions we are going to be using today all right and hopefully this is a review hopefully you have seen this before hopefully this isn't something you know what let's change this to red just because we can and let's move this here so it stands out a little bit more hopefully these conversions here are not anything new to you you've seen them before you've worked with them before and you are an expert in these because this is what we're going to be using for the next well for today's lesson and for the rest of your life, unless at some point in time the United States um, switches to the metric system or you move to Canada or Mexico, in which case then you should probably learn the, me the uh, metric system. All right, but let's start with a few problems here and let's just start with converting them, okay? First one we're going to do is we're going to go with 24 inches. And if I want to convert that to feet, how many feet do I have? And we need to get rid of this red. I'm pol I apologize for that. Well, it says here, whoops, that's not what I wanted. Let's undo that. Oh, can I erase that? There we go. It says here that one foot is 12. Ah, oh, I did it again. Boo. Okay. It says here one foot is 12 inches. So if I have 24 inches, there are 12 inches in a foot. I'm going to divide that by 2. And I, sh I mean by 12, and I'm going to get 12, I mean 2 feet. So look at another one. 24 feet, let's go to black here. 24 feet is equal to how many yards? Well, there are 3 feet in a yard, so I'm going to take this, divide it by 3. 24 divided by 3 will give me 8. Let's look at 12 feet is equal to how many inches? Well, 1 foot is 12 inches, so I'm going to take 12 feet times 12 inches, and I should get 144 inches. I'm going to give you the next three. I'll write them down, and then I want you to pause the video and then solve them. When you're done, start the video again and see how you did. First one is, we're going to do blank inches is equal to 5 feet. Then we have blank inches 
is equal to 3 yards. And then 72 inches is equal to blank yard. So pause the video, um, work the problems, and then when you think you have all the correct answers, play the videos and see how you did. Hopefully, ladies and gentlemen, you found some success with the with convert with these conversions here. The first one we're going from five feet to the number of inches. Well, we know there are five feet, and we know that for every foot there are twelve inches. So we're going to take five times twelve, and what we should get would be would be sixty inches. Now, this one we have three yards, and for every yard, we have 36 inches. So we need to know how many inches. Three. So we're going to take three times 36. When I take three times 36, what I get is 100. Oops, I need a. Let's go with red. 108 inches. Finally, we have 72 inches into yards. So we're going to take 72 divided by 36, and we're going to get 2 yards. Now, hopefully you understand all of those. If not, please pause, watch it again, look at the math, talk to one of your table mates to see how they did that. If you're still confused, you can find Mr. Winkleman. He, I'm sure he would love to help you out. And uh, once you get it, let's move on to video number 2.